In this video, I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot if your Wi-Fi is not working on your Amazon Fire tablet. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with the easiest and then work our way up to the hardest. So the first thing, we're going to make sure that it's not the tablet that's broken as far as the Wi-Fi. So what you're going to do is go to other devices in your home, whether that be with a laptop, a smartphone, or a desktop and then see if you're able to connect to the Wi-Fi router with those devices. If you are able to connect with those devices, then it most likely is your tablet. If you aren't, then, then it's not your tablet at all. It's something wrong with the router. Okay. If there's something wrong with the router, what you can do is reset and restart your router. And that's easy to do. There's a reset button on every uh, Wi-Fi router. Or you could just unplug it out of the wall. And then when you unplug it out of the wall, uh, re-plug it in maybe about 10 minutes later and then try your Wi-Fi. Okay, next solution is just do a reset on your tablet. Just go ahead and power it down and actually power it all the way off. You don't even have to reset it. Power it off, give it a minute, restart it, then see if you're able to connect to your Wi-Fi router. Okay, if, that's, if, if you're still not able to get connection, scroll all the way down. Look at your Wi-Fi logo here. And what you want to do is you want to hit it once and give it maybe a minute or two and then turn it back on and now see if you're able to get a connection. You may have been on a plane or you might have accidentally hit the, um, uh, the airplane there, the airplane mode. And if that's lit up, then you know that you're not getting Wi-Fi. Go ahead and click it and make sure you're getting Wi-Fi that way. Okay, next thing you want to do is try your device on other Wi-Fi networks or on other devices. So, for example, I have a, um, a smartphone where I get hotspot or, you know, teethering. So with a hotspot, you're able to get your own code. So use your smartphone, go on its hotspot, create the password, and see if, if that network is able to connect to your, to your smartphone. If that can't happen, go to a friend's house or to a next-door neighbor, see if you're able to get your tablet connected to their network. If not... You know, go to a McDonald's or somewhere local and see if you can get to a free Wi-Fi network and see if that's the issue. It could be that the, your Wi-Fi router is completely broken and you might just need to go ahead and replace it. If you're able to connect to another router somewhere else, it might be a good chance that your router, Wi-Fi router is broken and go ahead and replace that router. Try it all that. Make sure you have your all your files backed up on your tablet as far as saving everything like your pictures and all your information. Make sure that's all backed up. And what you're going to do now is do a hard factory reset if you tried everything else. And to do that, you just go to settings. And what you want to do is you want to go to device options. And then what you want to do is you want to do reset to factory default. And what that's going to do, it's going to reset it back all the way to out of the box to where it's like brain you again. And that will be your last solution. That'll be the hardest one to do because then you'll have to reinstall as far as like your pictures and all that stuff. But it'll put it back to out of box state and then you choose that and then it's going to ask for your password and then you're going to do a hard reset which takes anywhere from five to ten minutes. Okay, I hope I helped you. Make sure you subscribe. Put in the comment section if you have any um, advice as far as what to do in this situation and I'll make sure to pin it and put it on top. Alright, thanks for watching.